Water Life builds and runs water purification plants in parts of India that have no access to clean drinking water. Water Life has won the G20 challenge on inclusive business innovation and we have Rahul Chavan of Water Life with us. Yes. On the face of it, a water purification plant seems like a fairly simple proposition. What has Water Life really innovated on? Where is the innovation? Where does that innovation lie? Um, the, yes, we do have similar products uh, and the process that the market has already. Where we, where we differ is uh, the CSR. Uh, we do CSR for the companies, for the corporate houses that invest in our innovative idea. Uh, we go to the villages and we have this community development, uh, community water drinking plants over there. And around these plants, this plant becomes a hub of activity. We have uh, people coming in uh, we, who have set up shops there. So they, there is an income generation for them. So there are various activities uh, surrounded this plant and uh, people are made aware regularly uh, about the uh, water and the impurities that they were having earlier in the water and the clean drinking water they are drinking and also there are other activities being uh, taken for especially for uh, students uh, the uh, now nowadays like we are uh, already always keep on saying that the girl child they don't go to, uh, get a chance to go to school uh, but with this uh, we you can see that you know uh, we have because of this uh, community development uh, and community drinking water system plant right in the village the distance that the girl child travels usually uh, in our local uh, in our rural areas has reduced or probably uh, it has stopped existing as well altogether. so there are multiple aspects to this there are, and there at the are. heart of it is a collaboration with corporates yes large corporations yes. that are putting together the money for the capex for the water purification Absolutely. plant and then it becomes the hub for a whole host of other messages that are socially and economically empowering for the people who you're serving absolutely apart from the fact that you're providing them with clean drinking water yes so where do you go from here what is the expansion plan because even here at sankalp 2013 the focus is on our social enterprises really making transformational change and transformational change can only happen with scale so what is water life planning on the expansion side if you look at its statistics uh, india stands at 122nd stand uh, which is second last of the worst drinking water available in the in the, in the country's level um, so given the fact uh, we do not have clean drinking water all over india in main rural areas and as we are a young company it's just 2008 that we established ourselves and started our uh, service uh, we want to expand, expand all over India and probably beyond that uh, in coming years and that would help us not just to provide clean water but also develop the whole community and ultimately if uh, everything goes right the, the country will benefit from this. Well on that note uh, yeah. all I can say is all the very best.